A rare northern white rhinoceros has died in a San Diego safari park, leaving only three worldwide. The 41-year-old female, known as Nola, was undergoing surgery for an infection. Staff decided to put her down after her health worsened. Well, Kathy Dean is the director of Save the Rhino International. She explains why the northern white rhino numbers are dwindling. It's really unfortunate for the Northern White because their last refuge was in Garamba National Park in the Democratic Republic of Congo. As everybody knows, DRC's got valuable assets, it's got arguments with its neighbours, and so for years, for example, the Lord's Resistance Army, the Janjaweed Militia from Southern Sudan, would camp out in Garamba National Park and to launch their attacks on DRC government, Zaire, as it was then. They would shoot animals for bushmeat and then they latched onto the idea that poaching elephants and ivory for their elephants and rhinos for their ivory and rhino horn would earn the money with which they could buy more weapons. So I'm afraid it's an accident of geography. Um, so as far as we know, the northern white is effectively now extinct. Um, what about the southern white? There's about 20,000 animals left. So how good or bad is that number when it comes to conservation? Yeah. Well, it sounds like a big number, but it's not, in that this year is the tipping point year when we expect that deaths from poaching and from mortalities will overtake births. So in other words, this is the year when overall rhino numbers go into decline in Africa. Predictions say they could be extinct as early as 2026, so 11 years' time really doesn't give us long to try to turn the situation around. Researchers at uh, the zoo in question saying that they're trying to develop northern white rhino embryos that then they might implant mm -hmm. into southern white, so effectively <laughs> having these rhinos as, as surrogate mothers. I mean, has there ever been anything like that before, or what other more conventional methods perhaps uh, can we use to try and make sure that even the southern white doesn't also become extinct? Yeah. To be honest, the best, keeping the southern white rhinos alive, the best answer is to protect suitable, secure habitat. If you give rhinos enough food, enough water and security, they will get on and reproduce perfectly well. In terms of artificial methods, actually AI in rhinos has only ever worked in a handful of cases. And the exact, you know, you were talking about IVF and, and <laughs> embryo implants, that's never been done with rhinos. You might think that it's the same as breeding cattle or horses, for example, but really rhinos reproductive systems are very different. It's much more complicated. Kathy Dean from Save the Rhino speaking to me a little earlier. Well, lots more to come after the break, including...